The girls' bathroom near the dining hall, right? What did you say? That bathroom? The very bathroom. Huh? What? What about it? Shuichi, didn't you investigate the girls' bathroom? Did you find anything? It's good he didn't tell many people. Hidden passageway. One that's connected to the hidden room in the back of the library. Which means it's possible to get into the hidden room from that bathroom. What? Around the time Rantaro was killed, Nani. So went to that exact bathroom. I'm positive that when Rantaro was killed, the culprit was in the hidden room. Too convenient to be coincidence. Hold on, this is all so sudden. I don't think I understand. But maybe they got there from the hidden door in the library. No, I don't think so. Remember that I had placed dust in the card reader in the library. I was trying to determine if the hidden door was open with a card reader, but the dust didn't fall. That means nobody used that card reader. So, to enter the hidden room. They would need to use a different route, the girls' bathroom. Yes, I believe that's the case. The culprit entered the hidden room from the girls' bathroom on the first floor. And with the help of Mother Kuma, watched the situation in the library unfold. As soon as they saw the Kaede's plan fail, they waited for the camera to interval. Yeah, that would suck, Silent. It wouldn't be the mend all break all, but it'd be nice to be able to play those closer to release. Maybe that one's weird. It's like WB or whatever. Hopefully, I can get this back in time for Evil Thun. Remind me to ban that person permanently. Not just for a week. Before the end of the stream. In any case, the culprit attacked Rantaro with a shot put ball, left it in the library. Picked up the shot that Kaede had used and returned to the hidden room. And he also took the survivor perk monopad that Rantaro had, right? Yes. Oh, Rantaro. He left the monopad and the shot in the hidden room, headed into the passage. I'm coming in spell. I was days ago. And returned to the girls' bathroom. I left it to a week, but I'm feeling a little less cool right now, so I'm gonna be permanent there. I mean, a cosplayer would be a really good actor. Refute? It's, it's all just a coincidence. Oh, Kibo and Ryoma didn't have alibis. What if they went to the girls' bathroom? Did you see one of them in the girls' bathroom? What? If one of them had gone into that bathroom, you would have seen each other, right? But you never mentioned that. But that's... Maybe. What's the meaning of this? Yeah, I didn't know if there's just a, a real spoiler or not. So I just left it as a week just to get through the whole game, but... I like it was a legit spoiler, so... Nice and simple, man. Just perma. Even if it's not a big deal, it's more about somebody trying to be an asshole. <laughs> we don't do well here. We're all gonna get blown up together. I still wanna live. Who's gonna live? Who's gonna die next? I feel like Mom. I feel like she'd probably die next. Oh, 
Four Eyes is talking about. Bad guys never wear glasses. Anyway, just cut it out. We don't want to die. Monokuma and the Mastermind are the bad guys here. You don't want to die? Do you know how many of my friends were sacrificed? Uh. Please, help us! We don't know anything! I don't wanna... I don't wanna explode! Even if she is the culprit... Hey, let's just stop this! There's no evidence that she's the mastermind! I'll cut through your words! Mother Kuma's dead. We can't really test your voice. Mother Kuma told us something. How convenient that Monokuma and Mother Kuma helped us out a lot, though. So I feel like we're being led on, even if the information's right. It's still a sort of lead on in a way. That individual is, of course, the mastermind. When the mastermind commands Mother Kuma to give birth, it makes us fair. We all tried it out. Uh, but Kiba wasn't there, was he? Right, because I was fighting the Exosols. Did you hear that? Kibo didn't try giving Mother Kuma a command. So the real mastermind... Tamugi was the only one who didn't say give birth. Huh? Everyone else said give birth. Tsumugi specifically used a different phrase. You didn't say give birth. You said make. You knew how to get Mother Kuma to create a spare, didn't you? That's why you specifically said make. If you had said give birth, Mother Kuma would have made a spare. Am I right, Sumugi? Hey, come on. What's wrong? Don't be like that, Shuichi. Do you really think I'm the mastermind? Th there's just no way. Hey, everyone, say something. I'm not the mastermind. That's crazy, right? Then refute it. We're... Huh? I don't want to believe it either. That one of our friends, the survivors, could do this. That's why I'm begging, Sumugi. I'm begging you to refute me. I might be wrong. I... I was wrong before. About Kaede. That's why I need everyone's help. I don't care if my detective work is wrong. I want to hear your argument. Reaching the truth together is what cooperation means to me. Good man. Sumugi, please. Sumugi, please. Wait a minute. What's the matter? You can't argue back after hearing that. Whoa, hold on. I don't know what's going on right now, but just hold on a sec. Oh, Malaste's infamous impatience rears its ugly head. What an ugly head it is. I, I don't think friends should blame each other like this, you know? Come on, smile, everyone. I know we can watch a comedy special so we can all smile. Jeez, huh? you're noisy. Madasuke! Father, why? You loved Madasuke so much. Oh yeah, right. But we're at the good part now. <coughs> so be quiet and watch like good little pups. Father? <laughs> Definitely suspect. Exciting. Shuichi is trying to reveal the mastermind, trying to overcome despair. It's so heart pounding. Hey, yeah, Ripper. I'm glad they didn't keep him as some kind of staple. Better just to have him die. Maybe they're not on the same side. Maybe they're just separate entities. Obviously being led along this path. So many convenient pieces of evidence and 
weird testimony and shit. I'm gonna take a piss. Like, oh, the mother Kuma just happened to tell us some very important information and this all that bullshit. Mastermind of this killing game, and the culprit who killed Rantaro. The culprit. It's you, Sumaki. There are no other possibilities. You don't have anything to say? Uh, go Junko mode. Say? Even if you keep saying all that stuff, I still don't get it. Hey, let's stop this already. You're mistaken! Because we're all friends, right? Weren't we going to work together to end this killing game? This is a class trial. Uh. Although we were forced into these class trials by the Mastermind, that's how we survived. It was the only way. It was the only way we could survive. So please, Tsumugi, refute the evidence. Say something. Your life depends on it. Please. Tsumugi, I don't want to suspect you. I want to believe in you. I want the Mastermind to be somewhere else, like in the previous Killing Games. Mind, then don't give up. I'll cheer you on. Even if you say that. <laughs> Samugi is taking her sweet time, but waiting around is so boring. Plot of her ass hey, now. Who knows, Mom? Why don't we look over the case again? What? Come on, that's like your thing. Present the truth and end this! Cause there are people who don't know what the heck is going on until we get to this part! Now then, let's start! Still so much evidence left though. The good music. People in the dining hall.
the extra good music. So I'd have to be here with everybody else, man. I'm definitely starting to think that the mastermind deal isn't very important. We'll see. Maybe, maybe not. Shuichi runs. Started his head up and didn't kill him. Well, we would have known there was two, two hits. This is the truth of the case. With this new evidence, we would have saw that there's two hits in the head. Kaede and I were in the first floor classroom. We were waiting for the mastermind to trigger the trap we set in the library. Around that time, there were four people in the dining hall, including the mastermind. I actually saw that person say Samugi is a mastermind, but it was a couple months to it. <laughs> I figured as much. Not a lot of people saw it. I'm gonna try to lead me astray. Which I appreciate. The mastermind but. was probably irritated that no murders had yet occurred. <clears throat> We're just too clever for shit like that, or what? But they knew that I figured it wasn't bullshit for most of the time. Especially after Kokichi said he was the mastermind. I'm like, all right, well, that's definitely a smooth game. But the mastermind wanted some insurance. He's full of shit. They would take action if necessary. The mastermind excused himself from the dining hall and went to the bathroom. Well, luckily there wasn't really many uh, foreshadowing points until like right here. And from there, so it didn't really affect the much, but in the library, the obviously there's not the as much to pay off. Enter. Or is it Samugi? Oh, yeah, I was thinking that too. Maybe we're still deep down the train. I just uh, question more for me, if, other than it being Samugi, is how. Uh, How important is it actually? I should find that person's name before I forget. I probably ban that. Ten bans are for babies. If you're an asshole, you're an asshole. <laughs> it's not gonna change with the week. I don't remember the full name. Because it's on timeout right now, it's not on a ban. Does anybody remember the full name? I don't need the risk of somebody coming back on a follower only stream for more of spoiling. With the time limit expired, Rantaro moved the library's bookcase. Oh, I appreciate that, Gata. Thank you. If you don't want to, I could just I could just do it later. <laughs> yeah, I was like, it was hard to believe. I'm like, is somebody really this spiteful? Just because we're having like a little like discussion. I'm like, that's why I didn't know for sure because it was so retarded that like I didn't actually believe somebody could do that. I'm like, oh, I guess so. Which set off the Especially somebody who already said that they hate spoils. <laughs> I'm like, all right. Yeah. Double how much of a piece of shit you are. Happened the way we determined in the first trial, except at the end. <laughs> I 
I'm like, the detective was like, this is like been the best protagonist so far, like... <laughs> like I, I, I prefer the detective over Kaede at this point. She didn't seem like she had much potential. At the same time, Rantaro was yeah, it's hard to look more in the wrong than that person. Too bad though, somebody came in here, what, like two years ago or something? Unwittingly step right into the path of the Luckily, ship. that's not the big payoff. There's obviously a lot more going on. The shot rolled down the path I ate him. And then. That chic dude? It's a chick. Oh, maybe. <laughs> maybe it's a lie. Yeah. Fell right onto Rantaro's head, killing him instantly. Or so we thought. It turns out that was just what the mastermind wanted us to believe. In reality, Kaede's murder plan happened quite differently. I did put this on YouTube. I'd have to find that point and make sure to cut the video around it. It's familiar. Want it here or in Whisper? You could just perma ban it if you already have it. That's all I'm gonna do. I can do it if you want to whisper it. If you don't want to, you're too slow. Thank you, God. I appreciate that. Little flexing the power. Mastermind saw that Kaede's plan failed and stepped in to finish the Not that we'll probably see that person again, but I didn't lose a follower after that stream, so I probably still follow her. I wanted to do the honors, oh, I don't care. I just don't need to I need that person to come back and ruin anything. For anybody or me. The mastermind jumped out of the hidden room and attacked Rantaro from behind. And in their hand, the real murder weapon, their own shot. What well, if they didn't kill him in one hit, man? She's a pretty strong girl, dude. I'm not saying that, like, a chick couldn't Rantaro fucking kill you in one hit with the shot, shot put ball, but... but the masterminds. I mean, so 100% say you could do it in one hit. I don't know, man. Mastermind picked up Kaede's shot and left their shot put ball at the scene. I'll go go to. People try to divert me enough that it didn't end up being a big deal. The only part that matters is like right here, where there's not as much payoff or it surprise. The survivor perk monopad <laughs> Let's be real, Smoogie isn't like a massive surprise because she barely connected with her anyways. Those things in hand. The most plain, unassuming person's like usually one of the highest on the list. And the uh, Junko thing, I was like, all right. I really, I feel like I gave it away a bit. Because she could easily be cosplaying as Junko. I really don't think they'll just whip Junko out again, unless it's like a robot. But they've already done AI, so it's like. She kept not dying? Yeah, that's another thing. It's like a super unassuming person just somehow makes it all the way to the end. I mean, like I said, it could be a weed man situation, so. I don't want to chalk it up to Mastermind, but it definitely was more and more likely. So I was like, I was like, hopefully she dies, and that was all just fake spoils. But when somebody spoils something that immediately leaves, I'm like, it's probably assholes. You know, <laughs> you don't make a joke and leave. Like a joke spoil and leave. You know. The Mastermind had probably just finished their crime. Oh, there. Not a big deal. Hasn't ruined anything really, major, but pretty odd it happens there are followers only one when the first two games were uh, open to the public. And I got less spoilers. And reached the truth that Kaede was the culprit. 
but that truth had been twisted by the mastermind. I don't even know if this whole thing is true that he's going for him. Like, it'll be all be bullshit. After the murder, the mastermind left the stolen monopad on the table in the hidden room. And threw Kaede's shot put ball into the trash can. A little careless of them to not get rid of all the evidence. Yeah. How convenient. Or is it? No one would ever get into that room. But we did. Their crime complete. The mastermind went back for weeks, to the yeah. Passageway. Oh my dude. She could have thrown that in the hidden passageway. Duct tape to some shit, like hiding it, wash it off. Go hide it somewhere, like break it apart, go bury it outside, like. Surely she has another hidden compartment somewhere, she could have just put it all or like incinerator. In the trash, yeah, it's very convenient. Which makes me think we're getting led along, but I don't know how smart the game's gonna be there. The passageway led from the hidden room all the way to the girl's bathroom on the first floor. On the fucking most used bathroom in the entire the fucking place. To use the girl's so where did they go to the bathroom? Oh wait, they had bathrooms in their rooms. Okay, I was like, wait a they second. You're never gonna see them in this. Passageway. Whoa. That's how they moved around without being noticed. Anyone could have used the hidden passageway, not just the people in the dining hall, but looking at the survivors. Only you could possibly be the mastermind. If I'm wrong, please refute me. Please tell us you aren't the mastermind. Tsumugi Shirogane, the ultimate cosplayer. I better say your full name and title. That's the truth of this case, of the killing game itself. But we have so much information still to present. Well, what? Yes! What a scorching hot twist! My hand holding the detonator is dancing up! I'm sure, River. Maybe she erased her memory before this, man. I doubt it. Daddy, please stop this. Go back to how you used to be when you loved us so so much. How I used to be was more suited to a different story than this one. Huh? Basically, your story doesn't matter. I can watch this exciting development. Well, Sumugi, are there any flaws in Shuichi's logic? If so, then please tell us. Flaws? There's a bunch of flaws all over it. Then explain. Y you can do it! You can do it, Smoogie! E even if you cheer me on. It's not like that. I didn't do it! It's plain to see! Fight back, Smoogie! Come on! You can do it! You can! Daddy, you're tensing up again! I still want to live, so please don't push the button! Tsumugi, please just say something. If you don't defend yourself... It's Junko and Oshima! What? Because it's always been her. In the Hope's Peak killing game and in the Jabberwock Island killing game, Junko and Oshima didn't participate. She controlled the game from outside. Even if it's boring or repetitive, she's always the mastermind, isn't she? Then it's like that this time, too! It's gotta be Junko again! Junko and Oshima is dead. She's not part of this killing game. You're wrong! She hasn't been eliminated! She's... It's all Junko's doing! This killing game is her doing, too! Yeah! That's gotta be it! Cause Junko and Oshima is... Junko and Oshima is... Cause Junko and Oshima is... Junko and Oshima is. Daddy, please don't get so excited. <laughs> you press the button. Oh, Always Junko. She's gonna go like crazy acting Look or something. Look at our cute faces. Can you really bear to be without us? Hopefully, if she does the acting cosplay thing, it's like 
different. Like, you know, it's like emulating it, but it's like, or imitating it, but it's not like exactly the same. So you can tell. It's like kind of weird. <laughs> okay, time for a commercial break. No, it isn't! See? We're a good comedy group, too! So please, don't... <laughs> the double kill, man. Cause... Junko Enoshima is... Junko... Enoshima is... Right the fuck here! <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. Even if nobody was waiting. Even if it makes you go, what? Again? The Maka Aspa. The diva of despair takes the stage once more. Junko Enoshima, the 53rd. I wonder why everybody believes the cause box thing. I will such the, like... Everybody just being totally cool with it. <laughs> there you have it once again. They're definitely baiting the like, oh my god, we're sick of this shit kind of thing. I feel like it probably won't be somehow. Uh, I don't know, man. Her titties are always pretty big. The V3 eyes. Samugi was poorly written. Why is this law? It's intentionally bad, man. <laughs> well, does it? It's intentionally the plain Jane reference lady. No, that's not possible. Junko Inoshima is dead. But why did you call yourself the 53rd? It's a robot. So does Junko Enoshima. As you can see, I am a perfect reproduction of Junko Enoshima. So, you're just a freak pretending to be Junko Enoshima, huh? No, a perfect reproduction. Perfect reproductions are exactly the same as the original. Her logic is impossible to follow. Much like the real Junko Enoshima. Whatever it is. You're the actual mastermind of this killing game, right? So if we kill you, then that'll be the end, correct? Say me things like that. Besides, killing me never ends the game. It never ends the game? What do you mean? She's bluffing. Let's just kill her and get it over with. Wait, if force is necessary, it should wait until after we see what she... No need, Kibo. Because this class trial Why is Maki is always so dumb? What? It's already over? But it just showed up! You killed Kaede, and Monokuma covered it up with a false narrative. The class trials are rigged, and this whole game is illegitimate. Oh, that. Right. Yeah, I definitely messed that up. 